he sees me. He's getting excited because he sees me and he's one next. Oh, here he goes. Yes, I got it on camera. Good morning. How you doing, my love? Oh, I love your stretches in the morning. How's it going? How are you doing? Did you have a good night? Good nap? This is not a nap, it's a good sleep. You've been doing really good as far as not getting sweaty lately. You used to be super sweaty at night, now you're doing good. Oh, time to go back to bed. Give daddy a kiss. Cause daddy's all... Oh, thank you. I'm sorry I don't get to take you in anymore. Oh, you'll play with my... Play with my hoodie string? Play with my hoodie string? I'll get you. Hey, we eat your banana? Cause mommy's gonna be late if you don't eat your food. Got a nice little phrase going on. <laughs> Alright, I gotta go. I'm going to take the dog into get his vaccine because he hasn't been to his daycare in like a month so we kind of feel bad for him so uh... that's one of the reasons i did the one take uh... tuesday yesterday is because i'm going to use that edit time this morning to take apollo in and get his vaccine and then hopefully he'll be able to go to daycare if not he'll be hanging out with daddy at work oh man the poor guy really doesn't want to be in there he's trying to pull his way out he really hates being at any sort of doctors or anything like this but Oh, but they're gonna do it. They're giving him the shot. I'm, I wonder if you're gonna hear him do a little squeal or something. Oh, here he comes. We're all done. Finally, it's over. <laughs> Poor guy. Hi, but you made it. Barely. Oh, look at that sunrise. That's gorgeous. All right, so just got done. Got my official paperwork from Apollo. He now has his Bordella vaccine updated. So he is allowed to, come here, ah, come here. He doesn't have a leash, I forgot his leash today. But uh, we now have his vaccine updated so he is allowed to go to daycare again. So hopefully he still has his spot reserved. There's like, believe it or not, there's like a waiting list for the daycare. So I'm hoping he still has his spot and I'm gonna able to drop him off this morning and have a good time. If it's full and if he doesn't have a spot anymore, I'm just going to have to take him to the office again. But uh, that's fine, as long as he's getting out of the house. And it was way cheaper than... I, I love this this uh, St. Francis Animal Hospital because they're open 24-7. So I can come in here whenever I want without an appointment. And it was like 15 bucks to get his vaccine. Super cheap. Paul's one of the few puppies that is at daycare right now. Check it out, he's running around playing. Oh, and now he stops. Now he's on camera. He knows he's on camera. Anyways, oh, there he is, go. Squirrel, thirsty, gotta get a drink. All right, so baby chick and I are gonna go see her cousins. I got some Mary Kay from baby chick's aunt, and so we're gonna pick it up and say hello, and then hopefully when we get home, I'll be able to make dinner. She is, I don't think you can see her. I don't think I'm doing this very well. She is exhausted. Uh. Say hi. Uh. Yeah. Can I say hi? Uh. Yeah. So, hopefully we'll be in a good mood, but who knows. Uh. Go get that baby. Go get that baby. You can go check the mail with mama. <laughs> Give the baby a kiss. Say mwah. Good job. Okay, let's go check the mail. Ready to go? This is baby girl's cleanup crew. Boots. Boots. What are you doing? See all the cookies on the floor? He loves when we take her out. That's her little playpen. And boogers. Are you feeding yourself? Dip. Good job. Boogers, can you say yay? No? Here, let mommy put it a little bit further. There you go. 
You are such a big girl. Good thing we're getting a bath. Say yay. Mmm. <laughs> Good job. So independent. Yes, you are. All right, guys, I'm super excited. My uh, camera that I ordered a while ago uh, finally showed up. So I now have to no longer worry about the stupid variable bit or variable frame rate and matching audio and all sorts of stuff. Plus, this camera's got like stabilization, so now I won't be shaky anymore. So hopefully not as shaky. So I'm pretty excited about that. It came in a day early, so uh, I'm gonna open it up and take a look. The best part about getting Okay. What? Uh, Power shot. Elf 330. Yeah. Look inside. It looks like software. Canada. Software. Cardboard. Charger. It's so little. Oh my goodness, look at how small that is. That's perfect. Smaller than your phone. So now I can be like, hi guys, how you doing? What kind of stable, like, how does it stabilize? It's got optical stabilization and it's got a 10x optical zoom. So it's, it's led like phones which have like digital zooms. Mm -hmm. This one will actually do it all. Are you now. impressed, Michael? Lossless. I'm impressed. All right guys, so I'm super bummed. I came down here because I really wanted to test out the new camera that came in today. Yeah! Finally came in. It's, <laughs> I, I cheaped out on the shipping, so it was like a two week waiting period for it to ship but it came a day early. Uh, anyways, I came down here because I really wanted to test it out and like see how shaky it looked or whatever, but I don't have a memory card here and I didn't even think about that. Got the battery all charged, plugged it in, was ready to come out and do it, and no memory card. Well, I have a memory card, but not the right kind. Also, I came out here just because I needed an excuse to get out of the office. I've been super antsy. Like, I've been doing very monotonous stuff today, so it's like zoning out on the computer. Uh, Actually, I've been doing a combination of zoning out working with listening to slash watching Shaytard Marathon videos. Because I kind of want I'm going back and I'm watching from the beginning. Uh, and I'm at the part where he like, is just, he's been in like LA for the first time for a few weeks or something like that. So, uh, it's interesting. Anyway, so I'm kind of zoning on that while zoning on working at the same time. Ooh, I love lens flares. By the way, if you guys didn't know, I'm really into lens flares. So every time I see one, I like stare at it. Uh, speaking of like waiting for opening gifts or presents, do any of you guys ever, like when you guys get a gift and you have to wait, it's almost like Christmas morning is what I feel like right now is what I'm trying to express. Like I have the package and it's sitting there and I really want to open it and play with my new toy, but I have to wait until Christmas morning. It's like I'm counting on the hours till I get off work to get to play with my new toy. It's like waiting for Christmas morning. I'm sitting in my bed, waking up at 5 a.m. I have to wait and my parents said I can't get out of bed until 6 and then I get to go down and open the toys. That's what I feel like right now. I don't know if you guys get that way when you're waiting for packages. You check the delivery status online to see, oh, how many days till it shows up and what's the ETA of the time it's supposed to show up so I know what time of the day to expect it. I don't know. I'm, I get, get really excited to get it all built up and that's how I was and I was already stoked to uh, play with my new toy. And then, Oh, Christmas morning got delayed because I didn't have a memory card. I got to open it, which was fun, and I got to see all the little pieces and parts and put it together and charge my battery. But it's like you get your toy and then you don't have batteries to play with your toy. Like when you have like, you know, uh, something that requires batteries as a kid and you guys don't have batteries. So it's like, it's just another setback. <laughs> Anyways, I just like comparing myself to, you know, like a five-year-old child at Christmas. <laughs> he sees me. He's getting excited because he sees me and he's one next. Oh, here he goes. Yes, I got it on camera. Did you guys see that? I got him to throw it fast. That's the first time I've seen him do it in person. And then you guys were there to witness it. Uh, it was pretty awesome. Uh, anyways, picking up Apollo. I'm Short 
We're enjoying it out here, don't stop. Oh my god. <laughs> She's really good at singing, she just doesn't like to sing for you guys. Alright guys, this is the very first video taken with our brand new camera. Ash is whipping up some steakage right here, it's like, what is it called exactly? I just call it steak bites. So what exactly are you doing? Deep frying them, pretty much. Whatever it is, it's delicious. Um, so, how does the uh, new footage look? Is it amazing? Is it like the best thing you've seen in the world? I don't know. Uh, I'm just excited because I know it's going to save me countless hours editing over time. Ooh, and the house is starting to fill with smoke. Let's air it out. I'm really excited about this new camera. Uh, and Ash is going to finish whipping up an amazing dinner, and then uh, we're gonna go to bed. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here tonight, unless you had anything you wanted to say. So uh, thank you so much for watching today, guys. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed Apollo jumping over that fence. I was so stoked when he did that. I was like, yes, I got it on camera. Uh, anyways, as usual, uh, if you're new to our channel, subscribe. Uh, if you like today's video, give it a thumbs up and share it on all the social medias, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Say goodbye. Bye. Uh, this is the very first official shout out. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I talked about it yesterday in my One Take Tuesday. But basically what I'm going to do here is in the in slate, this little box, is I'm going to give shout outs for prayer requests, uh, happy birthdays, check out this channel's whatever. So if you guys have any shout outs, post comments down below on what you guys would like me to shout out about. Uh, if you have a channel you want me to look at or if you have a prayer request, whatever, let me know. So today's are... Uh, Sydney Urbeck commented on Twitter today uh, and it is her birthday so actually I guess by the time you're watching this it'll be yesterday but happy birthday Sydney and then also uh, for the first prayer request I wanted you guys to uh, be praying for baby girl because her surgery is Friday morning uh, so for you guys tomorrow morning uh, so if you guys would just pray that everything goes well and that uh, me and Ash just keep our sanity and don't freak out too much that would be awesome uh, so thank you so much guys and we'll see you tomorrow.